So why Fruhoff? Historically, Fruhoff is the largest, greatest trailer builder in the history of this industry. Today, we're gonna do a walk around on the 2025 Fruhoff dry vans. We have two models of dry vans, a standard base and a high base. We're gonna walk around the high base today. These are made in Bowling Green, Kentucky, right down the street. And we have them distributed out of Altoona, Iowa, Louisville, Kentucky, uh, over in Indiana, at our store in Indiana, and right here in Girard, Ohio. Both, both models um, in stock at all those locations. So let's get, uh, get into some specs here. The very first spec I want to talk about is the coupler plate. Coupler plate is the key on any unit, any trailer you buy, you want to have a good galvanized coupler plate. The galvanization process is to prevent rust jacking and get you longevity on the coupler. With dry vans, there's a lot of drop and hook. There's different trucks under this all the time. They sit, they rust, they wear. This is gonna help eliminate that. Get you the longevity. Coupler plate installs, when you have to replace them, get costly very quickly. The next thing I wanna talk about is the landing gear application here. Notice here you got galvanized apron plates galvanized K-brace, and galvanized cross members underneath. Again, in a drop-in hook setup, you want to prevent rust. You want to prevent this from getting weak. When the trailer is loaded and you drop it, the last thing you want to happen is this landing gear to fail. So this is a high base model Fruhoff. It's a 2025 unit. Notice the bottom rail you get the height there, a little bit shorter on the panels. Logic says the sidewall is going to be stronger, and it is. The strength of the trailer, though, comes from the cross members in the floor. In the bay area of this trailer, which is from the landing gear to the suspension, these cross members are set up at nine inches apart spacing, which gives you added strength where the concentrated load will be. Normal spacing is 12 inches. Fruhoff spaces them at nine. Back here at the suspension area, we run a Holland CBX suspension, air ride suspension with a dock lock assembly on the back. The dock lock will help you stabilize the trailer when loading. Forklifts in, forklifts out. The trailer's not gonna bounce, it's not gonna walk forward. It's gonna stay stationary during the loading process. Steel disc wheels with a tire inflation system. Tire inflation is automatically gonna improve your fuel economy and tread wear on the tire, tire wear. When all your tires are at the same PSI, they're gonna wear the same. This system increases and decreases the air going down the road. So those pressures will always match. Getting the life of these eight tires is key in expenses across the board. At the rear of the trailer, you'll notice galvanized door posts, galvanized top header, galvanized rear bolster, galvanized ICC bumper, fully galvanized. The lock rods on the door, fully galvanized. Again, we wanna prevent rust you're not gonna to have to paint this trailer in five years on the rear end. Composite doors, half inch composite doors. You're not gonna to have to replace door corners anymore like the old wooden doors. Your seals aren't gonna fall off anymore. Composite's the way to go on the doors. So now we're in the inside of the Fruhoff dry van. The roof is constructed of a 54-foot piece of aluminum with anti-snag roof bows. The sidewalls, again being composite, have logistics posts every four feet. The bottom rail, the key feature 
to the high base rail. There's no rivets. That is where you, that area is where skid loading, forklifts, all your general freight hits the bottom of that rail and it shears the rivet heads off. On this application, you're not gonna have any of that. They move the rivets up. That is why a high base rail might work for you. The floor, all hardwood oak. And if you notice, three screws per board on each cross member. Again, more securement, added strength to the trailer. So why Fruhoff? Historically, Fruhoff is the largest, greatest trailer builder in the history of this industry. They've come back into the United States, they're building a quality product, and they've brought back people from their past that have made that product so great, from their engineering department to their president of operations. This team of professionals and their beliefs tied directly into our core values as a company to help you, the customer. For any more information on these trailers, please find us at www.trivistacompanies.com.